The push to require body cameras on law enforcement taking the nation by storm. But in our states, there may be a chance you'll never get to see what's recorded. Good evening. I'm Sharon Taswell. And I'm Sean Maroney. Thanks for joining us. The bill is moving its way through the General Assembly. It would make video recorded on police body and dashboard cameras confidential. The bill now moves on to the Senate. But as our Phil Sanchez reports, the family of a teen who killed himself in police custody is speaking out against the bill. You talk to police officials across this country, they'll tell you that body cameras are to make policing more transparent. But the family of Jesus Huertas says if officials are the ones deciding what the public can and can't see, how exactly is that being more transparent? What if perhaps there was a video and now they have the chances of not even showing it now? Evelyn Huerta is furious. Her younger brother, Jesus, died while in police custody. Durham police say he shot himself in the head while in the back of a police cruiser. Police say the camera inside the patrol car wasn't recording, so there was no video and no audio. To me, I think it's very hard for anybody that's under the situation of having someone in the police custody or someone having to do with the police and not be able to see what actually happened. And now, nearly two years later, lawmakers passing House Bill 713. It restricts public access to police video, but the bill also changes the current law that allows cops to stop the release of said video. So this bill uh, uh, gives the uh, uh, agency the authority to release those records, uh, whether or not the officer uh, objects. Jeff Robinson has been in law enforcement for 27 years and is now director of training at Wake Tech. Anytime you have video without it being edited properly, it could show something or it appears to show something that may not actually be reality. For Jesus Huerta's family, that should be public point blank. What are they hiding? What do they want to hide? Time has not healed the wound and it maybe never will. I still have clothes from him. My mom still has all his clothes. You know, even though his um, ashes are, are, in, are in my mom's house, it's, I go in and I still have that hope that he's gonna come and make us laugh like he always used to. A bill regarding whether or not police officers should be required to wear body cameras here in North Carolina will be taken up next week here at the General Assembly. In Raleigh, Phil Sanchez, WNCN News.